What's going on guys? It's the FRS in here back with another video and today I finally got this part that everybody been asking me to get and it is the headlights. Uh, I think it's the Valenti headlights or Vlan. I don't know. I forgot what brand I bought but these are what the headlights look like and you know we gotta hook it up and also we do have to wire it to make the other stuff of the lights work so Looking forward to that. So this one's back there and that one is back there. So uh, we're going to get into taking the bumper off because we have to take off the bumper to get to the headlights to take that off. All right, guys. So first thing I got to do is unbolt the top bolts, unbolt the bottom bolts and clips and take off the sides to get the bumper off and then unplug these different lights and then we can finally get to the headlights. So, I'm gonna do that right quick. guys so i got the bumper all clipped off um i don't think i need to take it fully off but so we have to take off the screws of the headlight one two three and there might be one in here well bumper basically off now but uh one two three is all i see for right now there might be another one but yeah so i'm gonna take them off and then get back to it all right guys so I got this headlight in, didn't get the other one yet. The boomerang effect is not plugged in yet, nor is the turning signal. So I'm gonna have to wire that up to these lights. So, you know, this is not finished yet, but the main light is still visible and ready. So for this light, I'm gonna have to take it off and plug the other one up. All right guys, so I did put the headlights in and it does make the car pop way more. It's not truly done yet because i still have to wire up the turning signals and also the boomerang effect but this is what it looks like with nothing on which looks pretty clean compared to stock so i basically got my dad to do it since he's just better overall at electrical stuff so right now he's wrapping up the wires so it looks more neater and also so they don't get damaged or get too wet now he's clipping the ends and attaching them to the other lights cords so you know, everything can hook up and be right. So that basically sums it up. All right guys, so we got the headlights in and they're all hooked up now. And this is what they look like in midday. Um, and I'm, feeling, I'm also probably gonna show you guys what it looks like at night, but the white actually like pops still while it's still daytime. And I also did have the option to make like, if I'm turning like one light will blink, but I don't know if I wanna do that. So I didn't do that. <laughs> um, but it does make it look more aggressive. I like that. You ain't gonna stop messing with the car, is you? Well, there's a couple more things coming in. I know. You gotta do something to the hood though. <laughs> All right guys, so we got my friend with the GTI. It's gonna start raining. We're trying to get some rollers out. So hopefully you can make it. He just got it too, so it's pretty cool. But um, gonna go out. Don't mind the car, it's kinda dirty, but uh, hopefully it all works out. So stay tuned, man. Stay freaking tuned. They think I'm hiding in the shadows. 